Well, good afternoon, guys. Uh, I am getting ready to do a video series on all my four trail cameras here. Uh, you can see I've got two Maltries, I've got a spy point, and I've got a Tacticam. And I have my eye on another, uh, actually another Tacticam. Uh, may or may not have it by the time this video series is done. Uh, if I have it before then, I'll add it to the uh, end of this video, in this series. If not, I'll just do one on, on it by itself. Uh, this is the order that I did purchase these things in. My very first one was this uh, Moultrie Delta Base. Uh, my second one was this Spy Point Micro Link. And then I got the Moultrie Edge. And then I got the uh, Tacticam Reveal X. Uh, I bought all these within probably, probably a little less than a year of each other. I'm going to say about nine months of each other probably. Something like that. Uh, but I'm going to do a small breakdown of each each camera. I'm not going to go into a super lot of detail because there's a lot better, be a lot better videos out there than mine. Uh, all these three right here have been on a mineral site. I uh, freshened up probably about a week and a half ago and I've been leaving them up here for about five days or so at a time. Uh, the only one that's not been there yet is this one and it's getting ready to go up since this video is done. It's going to be up here about five days. Uh, but I'm... Uh, now one of these only takes pictures. It doesn't take video, but I'll get into that a little bit more in the in the in the, in, in its own little series when I do that. Uh, like I said, I'm gonna break down each one. I've got uh, I've got a little picture and video mode, so I'll be posting some daytime and nighttime pictures and videos, daytime and nighttime videos. Uh, they're all on the same tree at the same height. They're about 10 yards from my mineral site, and it's been getting quite a bit of activity. So. Uh, like I said, I, I put this one out first, and then this one was second, this one was third, and then today this one, because uh, this one was actually on public land until uh, just a few days ago. So anyway, guys, that's uh, going to be the opening of this. Like I said, they're all, the, not the same time, but they're all going to be on the same exact trees, same height, so they're all exactly the same spot on every, all of them's on the same mineral site. And like I said, i got about five days' worth on each one of them. So, uh, no, sorry, but I'm going to keep running back and forth with the camera, my wife's been ill here lately and she wasn't able to make it up here with me. She usually wanna have some in my videos. So anyway guys be looking for that little video to be starting up here pretty soon. Well if you're watching this right now I guess it's getting ready to start. So like I said I'm gonna do a, a video on each one separately and uh, break them down and tell you the pros and cons at least in my opinion what I like what I don't like. There's something about all of them I really like and there's some few things about uh, each one of them I don't really like that well but uh, we'll get into that uh, during each video guys so uh, appreciate y'all watching and uh, stay tuned for this well good afternoon everyone uh, we are here today to do part four of my trail cam series this is my last one I have, and this is the last one I purchased. I've been doing them in the order that I purchased, and matter of fact, uh, my first video just uploaded today. I uh, just got home from work, jumped up here, and wanted to get this uh, video done. This and my Moultrie Edge I just did a few minutes ago, because I want to get these uh, cameras out on some public land tomorrow. Uh, I took my other two cell cameras out on public land uh, last weekend, I think. And uh, I'm already getting some pictures and pretty nice bucks. So I've got a couple more spots I really, really want to get these out there today. So uh, I am up here by myself. Uh, my wife got home from work. She was feeling kind of under the weather still. Uh, she's still recuperating from her uh, issues she had. Uh, so I just continue, uh, appreciate everybody's thoughts and prayers. Continue on her. She is feeling a little under the weather. But so I'm up here today. So uh, that's why I might have to do a little bit of video in here by myself. I've got the cameras about as close as I can without. You know, get anything out of it, but uh, I'll give you a little bit better look of it here. This is the Reveal X. Uh, like I said, this is the fourth uh, camera I had. Uh, the Tacticam Reveal X. Uh, maybe I should mention that. This is the first and only Tacticam cell cam I've ever had. And go ahead and I'll give you a spoiler alert. Out of all four of my cell cameras, this one is by far my favorite. And I'll get to that in a little bit. Uh, it's got a lot of good features to it. Um, I did buy this at my local uh, sporting goods store where I bought my Edge. Uh, I paid $120 for it. I do have the box right here. Uh, I paid $120 for it. I looked on their website earlier today, and uh, they on the website they're selling these things for $124. So, you know, four or five bucks cheaper plus 
I'm sure you probably have to pay shipping and handling on that too. So uh, do have a few little notes just like last time. Yeah, you know, getting old, I can't remember anything. Uh, when you buy this, you do have to pick between Verizon and AT&T. Uh, I do have the Verizon model. Like I said, I've done it in all my cell cameras. Uh, I purchased this thing around, uh, I think it was around the first or second week. My anniversary is on November the 8th. I'm thinking my wife went with me, told me to go get it. I'm pretty sure this was my anniversary, one of my anniversary gifts. Uh, it was somewhere around the first week, week and a half of November when I bought this thing. Uh, Tickled with it ever since. I'm, I'm, like I said, I I really like this cell camera. I'll get to that in a little bit. Uh, like I said, it is a real, the Reveal X from Tacticam. I paid $120 for it. Whatever that. A uh, few little things about it. Uh, it does take 12 batteries, just like my Delta Base does. Uh, it does take 12 batteries. Uh, you do have to, on the app, uh, like I said, it has an app like everything else does. When it comes to videos, you do have to request the videos, and I've never had an issue. Usually, there's only been probably once or twice I've had to request more than once, most of the time, after, usually the first time. And, of course, that could have to do with your signal, too, you know, Wi-Fi or whatever signal you got. But most of the time, when I do request a video, I usually get it at the first try. Um, something, uh, let's see, yeah, it does, uh, takes great pictures and videos. I'm... I would put this up against any other cell cameras I have. This probably takes just as good, if not better, pictures and videos than them. Uh, just as good, if not better, than the rest of my cell cameras I have. Uh, the plans, I'll go into them a little bit. The plans are really not bad. Uh, they have one called the starter plan, which is $5 a month, and it's for 250 uh, pictures. Uh, it has a intermediate plan, for eight dollars a month, and that's up to five hundred pictures. And I've got the pro plan, which I only pay thirteen dollars a month, and I have unlimited pictures, and I'm allowed to download ten videos a month. Now the first two plans, I looked on the website, and I cannot see if they include the videos or not. And I'll tell you, I'll tell you a quick story about that. When I first got this camera, and like I said, I looked over the box on this one. It did not say nothing about uh, not sending videos to your phone. When I first got this camera, it would only send pictures. It would not send video. Now, the videos, if you have it on picture and video mode, uh, the, the videos do go to the SD card. But I touched on that in another uh, video, one of my other videos. You know, I like videos myself. I, I really like watching. It. it takes a 15-second video, and I just like watching animals react in their natural habitat with that, you know, not knowing they're being watched. I really love doing that. Um, but it has nowhere on this box does it say it does not send the videos to your phone. Uh, it does say it uh, on demand HD uh, photos, but it does not say anything about videos. And it sends videos to your phone, but you're on, a, on the app you can also request HD videos, which they are pretty nice, but I, the regular pictures I get I think are just as good quality as any, so and hopefully you'll see some of them at the end of this video. Uh, but about six weeks ago, it was actually right before our uh, turkey season came in, uh, they had a firmware update that allowed you to download the videos to your phone. And like I said, you get 10, with the pack I got is the uh, unlimited pack, $13 a month. I get unlimited pictures and I'm allowed to download 10 videos a month. After that, I think it's like five bucks a video to download. And I think Moultrie, I didn't mention that, but I think Moultrie is the same way. After my 10 videos, you can download more, but there's a price to it. I think it's like $4 or something. Uh, I'm not sure what it is, but I never I never go with my 10 video download. But like I said, when I, but I did not know that. If I know that when I first got it, I probably still would have got it because I worked with some guys that use tactic cams and they really, really like them. So even with that being known, I probably would still bought this thing just because I was interested in trying it. And I said, some of the features I'm going to show you here in a little bit, I have absolutely no regret on getting this thing. Uh, I did bring the booklet up with me today. It does come with a nice little booklet. I'm just going to touch on a few of the highlights. Uh, camera mode, you can put it on photo or photo and video. Uh, 
it has day and night mode, which daytime video and photo is full color. Uh, nighttime, daytime video is black and white. Uh, it has a 96 plus feet detection range. Like I said, I've never tested any of this stuff out. The flash, uh, in the nighttime flash, it has four infrared high power LED bulbs in it. Uh, it also has a SD card indicator to let you know if your card's bad. Uh, just take a class 10 SD card. Uh, uh, the SD indicator, uh, if it lights up green, your SD card's good. If it lights up red, your SD card is bad. I don't know if any other cell camera does that, so I do like that feature. Uh, it has battery indicator, uh, four battery indicator lights, LED lights. So if all four of them are shining, you're good. You know, if you're down to one, you know your battery's getting ready to die. It has a Wi-Fi indicator, and that's a pretty cool feature. I'll get to that here in a minute. Uh, has picture format. I believe you can do that on the app. Uh, it does have offer multi-shot, which I think my Moultries do that too. I'm not sure. As I do about these videos, man, I come into a little more details about all these cell cameras that I forgot to mention in my first couple. Uh, I always just keep it on one, but I think it has one, two, or three multi-shot. But I always just keep it on one. But I keep it on video mode too, so... That helps her. Uh, trigger speed is 0 0.5 second trigger speed. And it does have a, uh, on the bottom here, it does have a place for a quarter 20. And it does have a place for a solar panel. You can connect to that. And it's like all my other uh, my other cameras except for one. Uh, it does have a removal antenna. And like I said, if you tell on this antenna, it's a little beefier. It's probably one of the bigger antennas I've seen on a, cell, on a cell camera and like I said I have never had any issues and except for every time I go to put one back on here on camera usually when I have my issues <laughs> but I have not had any issues picking up any perfect signal 100% signal everywhere this camera has been so far um, has a speaker right here on the front so uh, your videos do have sound to them I'll turn around here on the back it uh, Right here's a slot for your uh, strap, which it does come with a strap. And right here, you can see, it kind of holds it out from the tree a little bit right there. And on the bottom right here, it has a place for your python cable and how you can see that. But like all my other, oh, and it does have another quarter 20 mount on the back. But like all the other ones, when you put the python cable in here, it locks the door also, so nobody can get in there. So now I'm going to show you a couple little, I'm going to open this door and show you a couple little features that I really like. Um, but here's the uh, QR code. You know, when you go to get this thing, you just go to tacticam.com. It tells you everything right here in the book, what to do. And then just scan that QR code. As long as you got a signal and the power's turned on, you turn it on to, uh, it has an off button, set up button, and on button. You just put it on set up mode. As long as you got uh, a little bit of your signal's good. As soon as you get good signal, scan that QR code. Takes just a few minutes to set this thing up. Now, it should pick up signal here in just a second. It's looking for right now. Uh, anyway, I'll go over it a little bit. It has a status light on the side over here. I just picked up full signal. I'll put that closer and let y'all look at that real quick. And I'll explain these. Okay. Status light. It's got full signal. Uh, the SD card is green. So my SD card's good. There's a little Wi-Fi signal right there. And I don't know if you can see that blue light it's flashing i'll get to that here in just a second it's a really cool feature and it has a test button right here on the side and right here on the side is where your sd card goes in okay and right here is the port for your battery eject for the battery case i'll get to that here in a minute too but this wi-fi right here what it does pretty cool you go into the app and i've already got it pulled up and if you look on your app it shows you all your recent pictures down here in the corner, you'll see a little person with a little uh, wheel around it. You touch on that, and it'll take you to this page. Okay? And right here, it'll say, connect to the re reveal Wi-Fi. You connect on that, and it'll say, step one, go to the next step, and step three. Guys, I don't know how you can see that. This camera is pointing right at my phone. And I don't know how you can see that red line through there. Yeah. 
There's a red line through there. I don't know if you can see my four in the background. Um, this camera, this Wi-Fi, with that red line going through the app on my phone, I'm getting live feed what this camera's looking at right now. What that red line is, it allows you to adjust this thing where you can put it exactly where you want to pick it up at. And not only that, whenever you do that, you hit that test button, and it'll send you a picture to exactly what this picture's this camera's looking at. So between that red line and that test, test button, you can position this thing to exactly where you want it to look at. And that's a pretty cool feature, I think. I'm going to go ahead and turn it off and save my batteries. And speaking of batteries, something else I really like that this camera makes me my, makes it my favorite camera. I did mention earlier that it does take 12, 12 uh, AA batteries. But Tacticam also come out with a... Oh, no, I come out of here. This is a lithium battery pack made just for these type of cam cameras. I know it fits this one and I know it fits the, the newer one that I'm looking at and it's called the uh, Tacticam X Pro uh, and they are 150 bucks. Like I, said, I paid 120 for this one. I don't know all the features to it but uh, I mean I'm looking at it. I'm either going to get it or get another one of these. I'm really really liking these and I'm probably I hate to say it but I'm, I love Moultrie. Uh, products, but uh, I'm probably going to be a Tacticam guy from here on out. Uh, but this, uh, it does have, it does come with a uh, battery pack uh, that fits up in here. I meant to bring it with me and I left it at home uh, that holds your 12 batteries. But uh, this lithium pack right here, like I said, it's made for this. Goes right up in there. And I paid 50 bucks, I bought that thing about a month ago. And, uh, I paid 50 bucks for it, same place I bought my camera at. So I'm gonna go ahead and, even if I don't get another camera, I'm gonna go ahead and get another battery pack. So anytime I can tell the battery on this one's running low, you know, just go to the woods, take you just a second, pop it out. My gosh, over the lifetime of this camera, guys, that's gonna save you some battery life. So I don't know, probably not, but if there's any other cell camera companies out there watching this video, guys, get in the game. Do something like that. My gosh, that is amazing. So. Like I said, between the battery pack and between the features of this thing, you know, the Wi-Fi feature, being able to get this thing adjusted exactly where you want it, man, this, I love this camera. This is an awesome little camera. So, and like I said, it does come with a strap. And right now, I have this uh, little feature right here. Uh, this is from Moultrie. Uh, if you just watched uh, my last video, which was my Moultrie Edge, you'll see that I bought a... Uh, thing from Moultrie that uh, fits on the side of the tree. It helps adjust it out. But it only made for the edge cameras. It ain't made for anything else. But Moultrie does sell a universal one. And that one was plastic. This one's metal. It's a little bit heavier. Uh, and it can be kind of hard to get the strap through there. But uh, it's got one oh my gosh. This thing. Oh my gosh. It's, it's torqued down pretty good right now. You gotta torque it down really hard because if not I'm not real crazy about this one. I'm looking at some different options because uh, you got to torque this thing down so hard because you can see it has a little ball in camera just this right there. But if you don't torque it down really hard, this thing will fall over the weight of the camera. will tip it over. And I've, I've got to torque down so hard right now I can't even, I can't even loosen it up. But uh, not really super crazy about this. Uh, it does have some holes on it where you can drill to a tree or a post or something if you're going to leave it up somewhere permanently. Uh, I am looking at a couple different options, uh, different things to do. I'm not real crazy. Just for that feature right there, you have to torque it down so tight. If not, this thing will move around. And uh, I learned that the first time I put it out. So I'm going to go ahead and use it for now because I got it. But I am looking for some different options. But like I said, it does come with a strap. And like I said, here's the box that it comes in. And some of the features on the back here, I'll put that right there. If you want to pause it and look at that. Uh, but like I said, you know, Tacticam Reveal X, uh, I've had this thing since November and I absolutely love it. Like I said, it's got a lot of good features. And I will tell you, as far as the app goes, this thing has got more features in the app than any other, the other two, uh, Moultrie or uh, SpyPoint. Then uh, this thing has a lot more. It's got stuff in here that I'm still trying to figure out. And like I said, I'm not very technological. Yeah, you can probably tell that by my videos 
Um, but I do try and I enjoy doing it. So guys, that's going to wrap up my uh, my review on all my uh, cell cameras. I hope you enjoy these things. Uh, that's going to put us probably in the end of June, 1st of July. I got a couple more videos coming out. Um, a couple more ideas for videos coming out. Uh, like I said, I'm going to hit public land tomorrow to get these things put out. And I dug my saddle out of my uh, storage last night and tried it on for the first time since, uh, I guess, end of, the, end of December last year. So, uh, definitely be uh, practicing a lot out of my saddle over the next, couple, next few months coming up. So, uh, guys, will be watching us for more videos. Uh, like and subscribe if you like all this content. Uh, like I said, I've got some things going to try to keep the channel going. But, uh, guys, in my opinion, all the cell cameras I have, you know, the only one I really have an issue buying was that uh, spy point for the price I paid for it. And like I said, it just does picture, not video. But, man, I, out of everyone I've got, guys, I would highly recommend this one over any of them. And I like them. I like, I like Moultrie products. I've said that before. But, man, I just think these ca cameras right here are really awesome. So, anyway, guys, thanks for watching. Uh, appreciate it. If you have any questions, comments, leave them at the bottom. I try to answer them if I can. Uh, like I said, this is just my my personal experience and my personal view with these things. There's only one of them I've had over a year now. I'm coming in on a year on the rest of them. But, uh, man, I love this one right here. So, guys, be blessed, be safe, be legal. Catch you, catch you soon.